So the project is all themed around a sense of place. So it's about spaces and places in our local areas and the things that we see on our way to school or on our way to work. Noticing the small things in nature. Coming out the back of the pandemic, I think we all recognised some quiet space or seeing nature is really good for our wellbeing. So that was the kind of starting point. It was very much about connecting um, people to their to collections in those local cultural spaces. Um, so finding um, relevance within the collections for people who may not have ever been in a gallery before. And then we worked with several partners in Burton, Stafford, Wolverhampton, Warsaw and Birmingham. So people did workshops with some amazing artists, looking at the theme, creating work, visiting places they might not have been before, and really looking at their surroundings and what's on their doorstep and connecting it culturally to what's available to us in all these amazing art venues. So today we've been uh, exhibiting the work of various artists and participants in our workshops uh, in the New Art Gallery of Warsaw. I've got to say it's one of the best projects I've ever done. I mean, we had two groups, one with Sanctuary Wolverhampton, a refugee group, and then a Heads for Health group as well. The synergy between the staff, myself, the venue, the participants has been magical. It just worked so smoothly, it was so exciting. We covered various aspects of art and each participant really got something out of it. We've been really happy to be working on a sense of place. We've had a great time, the groups have made some fantastic work um, and it's great to see it all here today on display and um, also to, um, to be able to have our own work in the exhibition as well. We've got some of our work that was in the collection that also inspired a piece of work that my daughter and I made during lockdown which is in the collection. And all of that fed into some of the ideas for what we could do in this project. It's all about how we might bring the outdoors indoors and how we could go out and use nature, even the nature that's just around us in the city centre, uh, as an inspiration and even as a material to make art with. And we really enjoyed the project and it's, this is a wonderful um, conclusion to it all really, seeing all the work on show. I've uh, done a performance drawing in, in certain respects. It's not a, a, a real performance but it is a live drawing and the difference with this one is I'm drawing with my feet and the reason I draw with my feet A it's a challenge and B you know I've always been involved in dance and martial arts and things and so I love using my body as a as a tool and and the fact that you can stretch all the ability of the body in various ways in some respects has a wow factor um, and it gets people trying uh, and I think uh, it's it's just been fabulous event today and you know people have used their arms, used their feet, used sticks, uh, charcoals on, on a piece of stick and so just getting everybody um, experience the joy of drawing I suppose, it's the joy of drawing. So the exhibition, we're delighted that it's here at the gallery, it's a real opportunity for us and all of our participants um, and we, what we think is that it's, a, it's kind of a window into the project. It's just a snapshot, it shows us just a moment where people are engaging because the product, the, the work on the walls, is just a little um, part of that experience. There's going to be a summer programme of workshops led by the artists um, and I think it'll be an opportunity for people to come in and kind of really relate to the work that's there and they might recognise places that they've been in. It's been great to see some of the participants here today and the groups coming and how proud they feel when they see their work up and we just want to encourage people to be creative in their everyday lives towards their well-being.